Hello, my name is John Hedrick with Schrader Academy. Today, we're going to show you how to update your TPMS programming tool and explain why it is important to keep up to date with the latest software available. As vehicle coverage continues to increase, our sensors must meet vehicle coverage standards. To conform to those standards, a software update will be required for your TPMS tool to extend the vehicle coverage in the tool's database. Keeping your tool up to date can save you a lot of time, and this will ensure that your tool gives you the best possible service and the most up-to-date information. To update your TPMS tool, it's key that you have the correct web launcher for your tool. These you can find on our website at SchraderTPMS.com. Located at the bottom of the web page, you'll see an Update Your Programming Tool button. You'll want to click that and then you'll see a technical support page that shows you the shortcuts for your software provider. There are options for a variety of different compatible tools. If you're updating a Schrader branded tool, you'll click on the Schrader Software Launcher link and follow the download and installation instructions. After installing the software on your computer, Open the application and connect the tool with the appropriate USB cable. Once the tool is connected, the program should recognize your tool and indicate that new software is available. The web launcher recognizes the serial number, license validity, and the current status of the software. In the background, if a window pops up and says your tool is not registered, please fill out the registration page. Should this page not pop up, this means your tool is already registered. You will only then see a pop-up that says full update or synchronize jobs. Click the full update button, put the tool aside and please do not disconnect the USB cable during the update time. If the TPMS tool disconnects before the update is complete, reconnect your tool with the USB cable, start the update again and the software will begin to transfer to the device. If the tool's software license validity is expired, you will not be able to run an update on your tool. You will have to renew the software license where you purchase the tool. You can also purchase open licenses that unlocks other sensor brands that you can program. We recommend studying different tools and software options available to you before purchasing these licenses, as in some cases, a brand new tool with software updates might be a better option. If you have any questions, feel free to contact us by phone on the tech support line at 1-800-288-1804.